James Tuckfield for Channel 4 News. Jacob, how was that? Pretty intense session. Yeah, it was uh, it was an incredibly tough session to be honest, um, but it was good. It was good to get the lungs burning out here, and um, it was you know we've had three as our third session now, so uh, definitely the toughest of the three, and, and things are starting to come together nicely. What's the focus in a session like that? We're a week out from the first game. I think the focus for the session really is just to try and. Well, to get the lung burn, I think, you know, and, and, and test us under fatigue, especially in the heat here. You know, it, it's the per perfect opportunity to do that. Um, and then, you know, just trying to get through our plays, nail our plays as best we can and, and uh, you know, just get those connections between lads that, that haven't been playing, uh, you know, together for a while. In terms of where we are, it's an unbelievable setting and the team have been coming here for a couple of years. Aside from the good weather, the good facilities, it's just a great opportunity to get away from from Dublin, the HBC and the distractions that go with that. Yeah, definitely. I think it's a really good opportunity, like socially within the team, you know, to, to kind of get, get a bit more connected and uh, enjoy each other's company. You know, like like you said, when you're in the HBC and you're in Carton House, although the, both those facilities, they're, they're brilliant, it can get a wee bit samey. So like, it's good to just get the, those social connections and, uh, you know, just go exploring around here a bit more and, and, and have a bit of crack. The end day tomorrow, so that opportunity to switch off and just, as you said, build those connections. Yeah, totally, exactly. Um, don't really know what I'm going to do yet. Um, might be just trying to recover from that session because it's pretty tough. But uh, yeah, you know, like you said, it'd be a nice day to just kind of get out in, in the sunshine, sunshine, and uh, maybe hop on a bike and go for a swim, something like that. I think mean, you switch the focus. Then obviously Monday is the start of match week, so it's that opportunity to recharge. But then also thinking about the week ahead. Yeah, definitely. Like obviously uh, next week there's a, a big test match coming. So um, yeah, come Monday Monday morning is is the start of that, is the start of that week and. And, and everybody's focus is going to be razor sharp there. So, yeah, it's not just having a day off and relaxing, but it's making sure we recover well um, so that when we're going in uh, on Monday that, that, we're, that we're firing. For you personally, you were back in in November. You're getting that feel for it, the environment again. How are you finding it all and what are your kind of goals and ambitions now in, over the next few weeks? Um, yeah, look, obviously it was great to be back in in November and I was, uh, like, I was disappointed I didn't get, you know, a wee game. Um, so it was, but, uh, look, my kind of focus over the next while is to get in here and train as best I pos as, as I possibly can and, and try and add to the squad. You know, like the lads that are that are playing in the back three right now are doing brilliantly and um, you know, like I'm it's very clear I'm gonna try and fight my way back in there and um, like that's a challenge I'm excited about. I'd say your your hunger for that green jersey is even greater now. You obviously had such a, a rapid rise in, in your early stage of your career in a green jersey, but is it fair to say after the injury problems you've had that you're you're running for it even more now? Yeah, like it's been an incredibly frustrating 18 months for me and um, I've missed that Ireland jersey massively. Um, you know, I was hoping I'd maybe get back into it a wee bit sooner, but like, I haven't and that's okay. Um, but yeah, like the, the, the hunger's there and, and the, you know, the, the drive in, in training is, is where I need to show it. Um, and yeah, I'm just I'm trying to add as much as I can to the team and to the squad and whether that's on the pitch in test matches um, or not, like that's okay. But um, I'll be judging myself on how, on how I train, if that makes sense.